Welcome to Star Stuff World Building, a weekly podcast and video series where we and you design a fantastical world and find a compelling story within it. My name is Lee. And my name is Alan. This is what we look like. And this is bonus episode number one, map making. Today we are finally, well I guess this is only the second form of content you've absorbed from <laughs> us, but we'll finally be making the map of our fantasy world. Yes, it's so exciting. Do you want to tell them how we'll be doing it? Absolutely. So we're going to be using a technique that we learned from the uh, World Building Masochist podcast group. This was like one of their first, or it was really early on in it their It was like, I think they're like second or third episode, probably. Yeah. yeah, it was an idea that I believe Alex, uh, I don't remember their last name, but we'll have a link down below for this podcast and then tag them so you can find their Twitters and yes. stuff. Yes. got the idea, so credit for credit. Is <laughs> <laughs> so basically how this idea works is you like pour rice over the yeah. mat. And it's supposed to make like more natural coastlines, mm-hmm. more natural shapes for the continents. This is going to be like the pre-flotation uh, period. <laughs> yes, exactly. And then from there, we're going to basically decide what pieces, pieces we're, we're going to be pick picking up. up. Exactly. Yeah. And I, I don't think we mentioned this yet, but the islands themselves are like parts of the tectonic plate. Yes. So we're going to be basically making the plates here. And then just pop them up. Yeah, so let's get started. started. (laughs) (laughs) Let's try again. Oh wow! Oh my god! <laughs> we did good. Okay, so for the first island, basically the idea is it's like a volcano in the middle of like a lake. It's a volcano inside of a lake inside, inside of, of a, a volcano, volcano inside, inside of a lake inside of a volcano. Yes, kind of no, but yes. <laughs> this landmass here, let's make a giant lake like in the middle. Okay. So like, is it fine? Yeah, what if this is the volcano, okay. and then mountains, I figure would be probably somewhere in the middle, right? I don't know, it's like this, like here. Like this whole thing? Oh my god. Well, just in this area. Then we need water, water, friends. Yeah. There. Others that I don't think really depend that much on the land, right? The only one that really depends is the levitation, or the footfall. Because it's like basically no land that they have. So what if it's like this spot? Like this is the main piece of land. Like it's a pretty small thing. I feel like like something smaller. I feel like it's multiple. Well, I feel like this one is actually multiple chains. So maybe it's like this. Oh, like these, like just this, like archipelago. Mm-hmm. So. <laughs> we should put something here just because there's like nothing there. That can be the light. The light. Mm-hmm. It's all our colors. Yeah. These two are so close to each other though, and I want to use that for something. I think the water is fine. Yeah. Because if you pull this up, like this entire set up, that's everything. Yeah. I feel like I really need a good, like, idea of what sizes these are, and I think they need to be smaller than what we know. Because I need to be able to understand the scale in my head. What if, um, 
here to here is 310 miles. Okay, or just 300 miles. And then here to here is 1,000. So, Louisiana to New York? <laughs> yes. <sighs> that was a very long two and a half hours. <laughs> It really felt like it took longer than two and a half yeah. hours. <laughs> but now we have this beautiful map. This was honestly, I was super impressed by how well this technique <laughs> worked out. If you guys are building a world or like just even like a city, just like try this. It was so cool. Yeah. So obviously we don't have time to go over the entire map, but we're going to highlight some of the key players before leaving you guys. So we're going to show you which areas correspond to which of the five magics we talked yeah. about in our first area. So the first area is like this archipelago. It's this chain of small islands, like really not big in the grand scale of mm -hmm. things. Do we need to go ahead and give them the comparative size to the states? It's like maybe twice the length of Hawaii. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and this yeah. one corresponds to float and fall magic. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Do you want to pick one to talk about that? Okay. So um, the next we have our push and pull magic areas. So that's going to be this landmass and this landmass right here. And which what we're going to do, since they're two different landmasses, we're going to go ahead and incorporate the pull, push and pull in there. So there'll be two separate things floating up here, divided like big area right there. And so then for the next one, we have our Sharon Steel Magic, which is this area right over here. It's a big island with some other islands around it. There's a huge lake with a volcano in the middle, and then there's also kind of a volcano in the middle of that one. We won't go too into that for now. Volcanoception. Exactly. <laughs> okay, then we have our um, Casting Cloak area, which is going to be this right here and it's also the biggest magic area I would yeah say. yeah 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 most the largest land mass well i don't know maybe considering the lake that's true Ooh, it's about the same size i think yeah and then we have our hum and hush area which is also a chain of islands and we're pretty excited for what we're going to go into that it's really cool yeah so our next podcast episode is actually going to be us talking about the geography and the climate, specifically focusing on these magic areas. Thank you for joining us for this episode of Star Stuff World Building. Be sure to shoot us a message if you have any ideas or anything. So we're on Twitter and Instagram at Star Stuff Cast. Um, you can email us at starstuffworldbuilding at gmail.com. Yep, and since this is YouTube, make sure to like, subscribe, hit that notification bell. And uh, please consider supporting us by joining our becoming a patron on our Patreon. All these will be linked below so you don't forget. Our next episode will air Wednesday. We always air the podcast on Wednesdays. Yeah, we don't know what day this is coming out. So, surprise. Surprise! <laughs> um, on this episode. But until next time, remember to shoot for the stars. And show the world your magic. Bye! Bye. <laughs>